Foxy buddies. So I'm just uh, checking on my car and stuff, making sure it's all legit. Oils are right, waters are right. And then we've got it jacked up. And that's because she's going to have a nice deep cleansing underneath to kill all them salts and nasty bits of crap that we get in the winter. That'll basically just dissolve my car into a little rusty pile of metal. So we don't want that. But in the meantime, there's a, a guy with a bushy hair on a video clip, a few video clips which I've compiled together to make a video. Uh, of a guy talking to you about a trailer from True Scale Trucks. So I'll leave you with him while I finish my car and then uh, I'll come back, see how we got on. If it's good enough, we'll cut it in and then, uh, yeah, I'll talk some more about that trailer because it's built now. <laughs> Ciao. Alright, guys, but Leyland again at the weekend. I see me with the trucks and I picked this up True Scale Trucks. From Adam Monk, it's Hercules hobby, and it's skeletal container trailer, just the trailer bit, not the container. I ain't gonna go on and bore you with what's in the box, and I ain't gonna bore you with letting you watch me build it, because I don't see the point in you wanting to watch me screw all day. So I have made a start on the chassis started this the other night in bed and it's all together quite solid it's rigid I got this just for one of my scanners usual suspects in the box you know all your packets and stuff everything's here just as you would expect it instructions wheels tires arches bags of nuts and screws and it's all there in the box. Basically you just get the kit to build it. So if you're interested in one of these or another one or different kinds, there's all sorts, trucks, trailers, or you have to like lesser upgrades and parts. Then if you're on Facebook, look up True Scale Trucks. And you'll find Adam Monk's page there. Give it a like, follow it, and you can uh, keep tracking, keep up to date with all his latest bits and bats that he's got to offer. And if you go on my home section of my channel, in the top left hand corner here, but it'll be the right hand side to you, there'll be a picture of a little truck. You click that, and that'll take you directly to Adam's website, truescaletrucks.com. If you want to follow on my group and keep up to date with stuff that you don't see on YouTube, I'm on Facebook and that's Scotty555Babe RC Trucking UK. Also, I have a page, the same. Feel free to give it a like. 114 Skeletal Trailer for my Scania. Now, I'll keep you up to date once this is done and I'll let you have a look at it complete. I'll build it first. So, this is the progress that I'd got. And say it's the simple kids could build these so don't worry about like levels and the instructions are so simplified the Chinese aren't they so they're a doddle but yeah it's just a case of getting the locks on these brackets down the chassis cross members in other side of the chassis onto the cross members and I've fixed the plates on top so far so now it's just a case of building up all the suspension and shocks and stuff get them on and the axles and a few little bits over here and it's done so thanks for watching guys have fun building happy RC well that's my car done uh, I hope that guy didn't bore you yeah? I don't know where he come from well uh Go and look at that trailer now and I'll talk you through it now it's built. Why well, thank you very much, Cup. So the trailer. 
It's finished. It was finished a long time ago. Well, when I say finished, it's built. I've just uh, thrown your basic Tamiya light kit in. I'll show you that in a minute. But the trailer, it's literally the same as your Tamiya trailers. It's Hercules Hobby, it's Chinese replica. Just stuck a little mud flap on in there. So yeah, the Skelly trailer, just like with your normal RC truck trailers from Tamiya. Usual suspects, your legs. Oh, pop them down. So when you actually truck up, your legs automatically pop up. Now, your brackets. These. I go over and hold your container on. You don't have to have it set for a 40 foot container. There are holes in the chassis here. It would be a little bit fiddly, but it'd be easier to do if you wanted a 20 foot container set up to bolt these into there and there before you actually build up your trailer. Because I'm considering a 20 foot container, which means taking these from out to there to put there and there. However, it's all nut and bolted up in there, which the top part ain't a problem. But if I can get a small enough screwdriver, I'll be able to take them out and then move them without dismantling the whole trailer. Comes on your same damper setup. Now, I'll be honest with you, they aren't as good as the Tamiya. The suspension do not really seem to work. But, like I say, this isn't a Tamiya. It's a Chinese copy from Hercules Hobby. Now they ain't a problem with these trailers, they really ain't. I haven't found a problem whatsoever with it, it's a good trailer. The only problem that I have got is I decided to faff about with my fifth wheel so it couples closer. <laughs> now it doesn't couple at all. So I'll show you what I did with another video there with a the fifth wheel. So it might be some pointers on you guys for what not to do. So yes, I learn bits through experience. What don't work, I'll share with you what doesn't work. And I'll share with you what does work. That's the point of the hobby, isn't it? So we can all learn. So yeah, the light kit. So I'll go ahead now and uh, I just need to wire a battery up to this truck. Now this light kit works with the MFU, the multifunction unit. I have the MFU R1 in there as you can see. It's in there, it's everywhere. It's an unfinished truck. It's nearly there. I just need the interior to build up and then drill in the top of there to feed that wire out of the way. <laughs> hate wires, hate wires. Right, trailer, trailer, trailer. Hopefully you guys can see there. So. No lights. Indicators. One. <laughs> and hazards. I haven't got a reversing light in there yet. I'll need to tap a reversing light in there. And that's your basic time I like it. Now my plans for this trailer is, I'm debating whether to take it apart, well the bits that need to come off, and spray gunmetal like I've done on my T-cab, so I have a gunmetal chassis, <laughs> but I've bought it for this truck really, and this has a red chassis, I don't know if I can see over there, so what I'm definitely going to do is, the side run the run bars, and the arches and the back bits here like the light housing and stuff I'm definitely going to do that blue so then that flows around with the trucks but the actual chassis I don't know whether to just leave black or really faff about and spray it gunmetal so yeah for the money really you can't really argue with it it is a 
it's a decent trailer. It's just decisions time. That's the only problem with building. What do you do? Do you do you paint it? Don't you paint it? I think it looks all right in black. So for now, skirts on the run bars, and then you know series mount and light casings, rear bumper and bits. They'll all go blue. So at least it has some form of floor. And then it's just odd little bits of accessories that need putting on, which I haven't finished yet, like chocks in the little boxes here, and then some spare wheels for the trailer to go on, which I'm sure I've got some spare wheels somewhere. And that's pretty much ready. And then it's deciding whether it's a 20 foot container or a 40 foot container. Or even just another trailer and a fourth. It's just everybody goes mainly with the 40 foot containers. I like to try and be a little bit different. So a 20 foot container would be ideal. But yeah, that's the basics to this trailer. Uh, it's available from Hercules Hobby. I think the other guy said that earlier. You can go and look him up. Also, you can find me on Facebook. That's Scotty555Babe, RC Trucking UK. You can like the page also. And feel free to join the group. You know, all the links, everything else, if you go to my homepage on my channel, in the top right-hand corner to you, will it be? Yep, top right-hand corner. Uh, you'll find all the links there, which take you to Facebook, Instagram, everything. So for now, you guys uh, take care. Have fun with your builds and your projects. Happy RCing. Hey, I know this won't really much of a review, but... There it is, you've seen it, you, you get the gist, but uh, as you noticed I started this video last year, the footage just went somewhere, I don't know where that went, but I come across it again anyway, so I've managed to put that back together for you, not how I would have liked it to go together originally as planned, but it's done, so yep, yeah, there's a trailer from Hercules Hobby, and again, please feel free to leave a comment down below, hit that subscribe button, Turn on them notifications and I'll catch you in my next video. <laughs> Ciao for now guys.